compound clips are essentially containers within your timeline. It allows you to group multiple audio and video clips, regardless of whether they're arranged serially or stacked on top of each other. Think of it as a folder of your clips within the timeline. The folder then acts as a single clip. To get started, we're first gonna have to select some clips. Choose the clips on your timeline that you want to group together. You can select them individually or use in and out points for a more precise selection. You can even grab portions of clips. If you've selected a group of clips, you're going to right click on one of the clips and choose new compound clip. If you've selected in and out points, you're going to right click on the timeline range, then click convert in and out points to compound clip. Give your new compound clip a name and click create. Your selected clips are now a compound clip on the timeline and a copy is saved in your media pool. And now every aspect of DaVinci Resolve operates as if this is just a single clip. If any adjustments need to be made within the compound clip, all we need to do is right click on the compound clip and go open in timeline. This will open the compound clips contents in a separate timeline. From here, you can edit the individual clips within the compound clip as needed. To return to the main timeline or a desired timeline, we can double click on it from the media pool or you can find it in the dropdown above the viewer. We can turn compound clips that are already placed on the timeline back into individual clips by right clicking on the compound clip and clicking decompose in place. If your workflow consists of decomposing compound clips regularly, you might want to give an editing option a try called decompose compound clips on edit. That can easily save a couple of steps. Compound clips offer several advantages. The organization one's pretty noticeable. Keeping your timeline tidy also helps with simplifying the editing process as you're able to treat a group of clips as one, applying effects, transitions, and adjustments to the entire unit. Things get a little interesting when you get into compositing and grading. While on the main timeline, you can grade the compound clip as one item, you can also open the timeline of the compound clip and grade each item individually. And that's compound clips in three minutes. If you'd like to see more short videos like this one, hit the like button.